All right, and in this new episode of Tezilovich, well, the Empire of Bosnia is still there. It has lived to tell another tale. And it's quite a tale, I can tell you. Okay, well, here it is. This is the recent new emperor, Emperor Ostoya the Great, even though he's only 19 years old. Ever since he was five years old, he got the nickname the Great, after winning that crusade, which most of the work was done by my father, who is still alive, surprisingly. And apparently I am the heir of the Grand Principality of Minsk. Minsk? Yes, Minsk. Ostoya here. Been married to the Grand Princess, and this is the Duke and Grand Prince. He's the principal's man. And I might inherit this piece of land soon. <laughs> Even though I kind of do not want that, because that should belong to the Russians. The Russians deserve that land, and they deserve their independence as a Catholic kingdom. And you are not making things easier. I mean, you know what your father and... Well, you know what, my father, and you, know, you, you had issues, but I'm glad you worked things out. Whereas, meanwhile, my own issues. Father is still away at the Teutonic State, and he suffers from the gout, which he could die anytime soon. I feel like there is no way you can get rid of this um, evil Hulkmeister. So he can be the Hulkmeister. Imagine that, if Vertigo, who is the former emperor, becomes the Hulkmeister in his life. Not to mention he's got all the artifacts and that means all the future Hulkmeisters will have all of the stuff that's been around since oh like that one artifact that's dated from the days of Vladislav. So I guess this stuff I have here except for this one basically represents well this is a new era in Bosnian history. But we still look to Vladislav and Helen for inspiration. <sighs> Had to take a drink. Also, I'm a left handed homosexual emperor. And honestly, I am trying to stay away from that homosexual business. I mean, I'm not gay. Not that there's anything wrong with that. I mean, I'm not against gays. <laughs> but you gotta admit. At least, uh, this emperor here, he's kind of a handsome young man, honestly. But that's all I'm going to say about that. Right now, my focus is on hunting. I want to be a man, dammit. Well, don't be too far of a manly man where men would fall for you. I mean, you're not exactly good looking, you're just normal looking. Because, uh, you're not groomed. And one of these days, i got to get married. But the problem is, my sister Stav is betrothed to this man, Tomislav Tezlovich. He may be a Tezlovich, but I'm antagonizing him because I can't break the betrothal. Assassinating him is too... Oh, I can invite him to go, but what good would that do? I mean, putting him as frontline commander and hopefully he would die isn't going to work either. He's got too much good skill. <laughs> Look, I'm just going to keep antagonizing him, and I'm going to keep kicking his ass. Well, I'm sorry that your daddy's in jail and your mother's a stutterer. <laughs> I'm just trying to come up with the insults. Listen, I'm on fire today. And right now, we have to support uh, Poland. They have 7,000 troops, while these guys that they're invading for Prussia have 11,000. Well... I'll get my own personal troops. No vassal troops. Because they're still mad as heck. And you know what? For once, put me on the front line. I'm ready to prove to myself that I could be a great warrior as my father. Yeah, me and more of my daddy issues. Oh, 
Oh yeah, that's another thing of them having Prussia. They have access to ships now. They have a navy. Yeah, I'll stop swaying to Koran. I'll figure out who can I sway. Who's still mad at me? Of course. Pax. But you should demand gavel kind, because if you don't hold it two duchies, it isn't gonna do no good to nobody. He's been excommunicated. Well, you're back to prison. Treason! How dare you! Also, I could take Bulgaria? Aha! Uh -huh. But the problem is, Serbia, they hold a bunch of this land. Okay, do take it. Give it to us. Fight for them. Gotcha. Right. Here you go. Bulgaria for Bulgarians. Once and for all. I'm sure I will create the kingdom title of Hungary in the future and just create some of the vassal lands here. And you refuse? And you gave me another threat because of you expanded. How could Tommy stand to look at himself in the mirror? I wonder, if God struck him with such a grotesque and repulsive face, I must have good to make fun for it. I am not letting you have sex with my sister, ever! Most disgraceful part here. Oh, I got a better idea. I know how to piss him off even more. You come to the court. Let's get up there and help him. And put me in the center. I know what to do with him. Hey, Tomislav, guess what? You're the court jester! Bosnia's first court jester. Kept around to provide entertainment, general entertainment for the court, also known as a fool, and is generally not considered to be the most prestigious officer at court. Yeah, just to say, luck, you're a terrible person. Oh, bingo! I made the right decision to bring him to court. Hey, look everyone, it's a jester. Kill this fool. Told you, I'm on fire today. This is my third episode of recording the same day as you saw in the past two episodes. Not tired yet. Told you, this is a new era. All the old traditions, gone. I'm no longer the... Did you finally have a child? Primal damage. I see. Alright. My co conspirators sent word that a massive pit of manure has been prepared under the floorboards and been abandoned in on a path. Tell me so we'll travel with escort. Once they're seated at the table, kaboom! Yeah, we scared him off. <laughs> Feel concerned for Poland, though. Oh, sh well, he knows. So we go. Give me that.
Back to the right corner. Hold on, there's one. Alrighty. A little quick and easy one would do. Oh yeah, there's this one thing I forgot, which this whole situation has been overshadowed with. The ruling dynasty of the Jabir dynasty has been overthrown by the zealous and hard living tribesmen of the Jaladin dynasty. The decadent sultans have tumbled, freeing any vassals from their founders to, to the unworthy sultan. But the sultan had gone, time will tell the worthy dynasty about the task of restoring authority in the region. That little place. Okay, those loaded fools. Oh my goodness. Jerusalem is losing its grip. Muslims are really taking it home. Well, you better hope that in the future. Next crusade, we're coming back to Jews. Or even up against uh, Novatia because it's getting too big now. Yeah, a big crusader state of Nobatia will be good for everyone. But not so much from the Africans. Which I feel sorry for them. Hell no. <laughs> That's all I gotta say about that. You are not marrying my sister. Because it's not a matrilineal marriage, so... Unless I can make a matrilineal. Also, I would prefer somebody strong. And which again, I cannot break the patrol. Because this jackass needs to die. We're still in the process of assassinating me. So whatever message comes up, don't answer it. <laughs> because no calls. Now, where was I? about the one thing I forgot? Jerusalem wasn't one of them. It's the Mongols. I thought they were going to devastate the countryside, but... No, they've advanced some. But they've never really gone this way. They lost their big hordes. What happened? Well, they're still on the offensive. But, um... Counties of Paul. Guess it's for that area. Sorry, I had to move the headset around because it's a little itchy. So yeah, the Mongols are advancing. They just haven't lost so. They just lost so much troops. And the Chinese have took China back, but they're suffering from devastating plague, unfortunately. And you people. You people got to do something about the British. It's becoming a new enemy once we deal with the people of the Germanic faith. But don't worry, the Teutonic state will always support um, Sumi's independence. And Vertigo the Great is still doing great. I'm going to feel sad once he dies. But I hope the Pope will canonize him as a saint. I mean, I mean, uh, beatify him. Beatify him as blessed. Hey. I hope you'll do the right thing. Oh, look! The Cardinal's got new headgear. Now, let's just get this... Uh-oh. What are you doing? Oh, Venice and Pagusa. Never mind. They'll be doing all right. Died by poison wine. Okay, you homosexual guy. I know you had saw something in me, but I need you to do me a favor, alright? Let's get rid of this bastard of a kinsman. Alright. Never knew the name of this killer. 
think I'll celebrate with dinner. Done and done. Alright, sister. Now to get your matrimony married to somebody. Somebody rather important. I was about to say, anybody from Finland? I mean, is there any unmarried guys up in... Although, I don't think they'll go for it, but... Oh, no, no, no. Get away from that. Born slow, that's bad. What about somebody from Ragusa? There's a lot of Dalmatians out there, and I'm sure there's a lot of singles. Footed, slow fever. Bingo. No, wait, wait. This is Patricia Mons, you're gonna make it extinct. You're thinking of someone else. Oh, just go find somebody strong. Oh, let me start that. Somebody of my religious group that is not married and is a man that is close to us. Okay. Now, is there somebody strong out there? Up the age a bit. Gee, all these bishops. Here to the city. Oh, wait, strong and attractive. Okay. I guess uh, we found a winner. We got a winner. The Duke of Dracon. What are the odds? It's right here in the Empire. Ding, ding, ding. But now, as for my marriage, oh, don't worry about that. Just wait ten years and I'll get married. Just don't worry about that. Now I can finally give that Duchy to Serbia. Or... Screw them over and, and give Bulgaria some power. So, ha 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 ha. I mean, I, no, no, I mean, no hard feelings. I'm just trying to be, I don't know, be a screw up these days. Yep, they call me the great. Wait a minute. Is he the guy that I. Oh no, different, different from yourself. That's Tommy Slav. That's who you're thinking of. This is a different guy. I said, let's be his name. I'm glad it's another f person from the Tesla which I see. And apparently, it doesn't matter if you're homosexual or not. That would prevent you from being beatified. That's just a lifestyle. Huh, oh, thanks for that lesson. It's okay to be a homosexual as long as you're devoted to your, not to your faith and have all the good virtues and stuff. There's nothing wrong with being a homosexual. I mean, look, I'm homosexual. I'm talking about Ostea. I'm just being in character. See? It's just something happened in that part of life, and, uh... Um, so, yeah, that tends to happen. Hildebert. Odd name, but he's a flanker. Need to get out more. Oh, yeah. The traitor. What happens if I were arrested right now? 
Because he's the guy that turned down my offer. Get the marshal. Up the arrest can't. But I'll simply ask him. Just one little thing. Just want to see, you know, hey, how's it going? Yeah, that's wonderful. Now off to Remember. The reason I want to get rid of him because he didn't want to make a gavel kind. Because I would rather see these two duchies split. How many troops does he have? He can hire more mercenaries. With that amount of number. What are you doing so up there? Okay, just all the local troops, and that includes the local vassals. Once this war is over, there's another thing I would have to do, another thing to get, which I have a tendency to forget. <sighs> so we don't have to worry about the Mongol invasion, that's what I've just learned. We've learned about their strength. They don't have the strength to invade the whole world again. Life's done some crazy things with you. Well, I'm going to be heavy infantry later. Oh, don't worry, you got this. You got more numbers, do you? You'll be fine. I'm not intervening any more of their wars. Watch me. I'm gonna break another one of my promises. Because I just can't contain myself. Yeah, gather everyone there. I wanna see everyone go to Dilla and we're gonna come in and crush them. Oh here's the thing. King of Bohemia. He can be the marshal, just to keep him happy. <laughs> Scratching my beard. Even though this character doesn't have one. I don't think he needs one. I like the way he looks. Long hair with no beard. That's the look of a handsome young man. Jump him! Dalmatian uncle. Alright. King Ladislav III has sent me a gift. It's a small puppy with the finest pedigree uh, and destined to grow into a great hunting dog. Alright. I call you. Uh... Oh, not that people. Gee, that's it. That's all I have. Two traits. Brave and uh, guys. I'm sure more will develop on me. I'll be hunter. That's what I want to be. Calatrava has declared war against the Empire to claim of Bohemia. Castilian Tezelovich. Ay, yay, yay. Little Miso. Who is Little Miso? That's the guy. Well, found a new guy to antagonize. Man, is this what I become? A guy who has no regard for his own kin, not even his own? Huh. I'm set next to Fernando. Um at a dinner and he tells about a family of Muslims which was attacked in his capital Navarra. Nothing angers 
me when people are persecuted and armed simply because of their faith for now no grounds. Clearly you are Shia. I don't know why you tell me this. But they were Muslims and they only have themselves to blame. God dang it, man! Fernando Gomez. <laughs> Wally Gomez. Now you surrender. There is no peace with Pax. That's white peace. We don't accept white peace offers anymore. Been fooled once and I'm never gonna be fooled again. Well, how many are there, by the way? Say, what do these guys have to do with anything? Oh, thanks. Huh. My dog is growing quickly and is no longer a little puppy. He runs fast and has a keen nose. He bites hard too, as several of the dog handlers can testify. Hmm. A biting dog. Jesus is strong for it. The local St. Helen was an inspiration in many ways. Wish I could live up uh, to her. Lately I visit her tomb a lot and listen to tales of her miracles throughout her life. I will live up to her ideals. I want to be well liked across the empire. And yet I've been doing some pretty silly stuff lately. I guess I'm a dog guy now. <laughs> Despite now being his opponent in war, I still feel if I could try to reach on Duke Gore in some way. You can sway somebody at war? I didn't know that. Ah! I could do that. Compliment him. Hostilities? He's the guy to refuse my offer. Wow, swaying somebody while at war. Hmm. Okay, let us meet under armistice. Um, I have a meeting and discuss my reasons for fighting. And he doesn't trust me enough to... Curse this. You better not take a piece of that territory because... It's going to be leading to some more problems. Whoops. Oh, there they are. Palazzo Polani. Italian. We can't recruit you. Oh, 
Want it over with. 100%. Alright, now go catch him. Hold this fan. Now hold on, Dalmatian Uncle. You wait for me. Also, you're in prison, right? What the? What happened to the old one? Oh, as soon as the war... Uh, oh, gee. On the same day as... No, no, no. The war ended day and I made a move of it. And already he died in the dungeon. He just couldn't handle it. What's... I still demand gavel kind. Should you refuse again, there's gonna be hell to pay. And nobody wants hell to pay. Thank you. And we hope for those two realms to split. Don't worry, I'm gonna catch him finally. You're the most disgraceful prince. You don't deserve Bohemia. Based in, by the way. All the hell way over there. Okay. Jerusalem is falling. Which matter of fact, there isn't much of Jerusalem left now. But the Visitines will try to take it back. Still gavel kind. All right. There's there's Bavaria. All right. Now let's um get this land back. Force vassalization. Zealous, tough soldier. It's all you know. Well, then, in that case, some of our old ones have died. I'll put you in. Where the hell are we going? Do they even have troops anymore? Send a small force. Take that castle. Where the knights of Galatrava live.
Okay. Question is, who wants it? Do you desire it? I mean, you held all these duchies. I'm gonna say hell yeah. <laughs> If you want to expand, go for it. I ain't gonna stop you. That's part of Galicia over here. Not the cave in North Zone. Not that terribly concerned. Everybody wants to invade Sumi. The British are at it again. The blood of Vladislav Teslovich flows through my veins. Since the days he walked the earth, we abandoned our old Slavic faith. However, I do see the merits in the ways that helps shape such a legend. No, the ways of old belong in the past. Hope there aren't that many in there. No, we can take it. Just give it time. Yeah. He's old. Put him out of misery. Bulgaria did it again. Alright, stop antagonizing him. It's over. That's one war ended. Just end this damn wall already so I can go hunting. Oh, and we have to get this county back too, unless you wanna. Alright. Be that way. I have no problem spending more prestige on getting this other piece of land. Who died? Vatilo Tezlovich. Don't know that guy. German Irish Uprising in Vihar. That's in Transylvania. I'm sure Bulgaria will take care of that. Famous Herald. Level 12. Who are you exactly? You ain't that good. You 
You're back in the Empire now. And now let's deal with those guys. After giving advice on, on a delicate matter, my courtier asked me to accept a small gift to go with this. Thanks for my help. And we got charitable. Another raving mob of German high infidels have risen up in Bihar, reinforcing the ongoing uprising. Infidel scum. We're going up there against them. Well, at least some of them. You know how many of these guys are? <laughs> Always. A Jewish dwarf. Hey. We got ourselves a court dwarf, ladies and gentlemen. Possible future spy master. As long as you don't piss off our vassals, then that's fine. Another invasion. They really want it back. And yet sometimes I wish okay, at least they're still helping Finland. They will always help Sumi. By the way, how many are there? We didn't assess the threat. Fourteen thousand. It's the reason why we there's a Teutonic State. We need to wipe out all the invaded German Arctic so there'll be less Invasions and less raiders. And what the hell is going on up there? At least they're keeping them busy. Mm -hmm. We're going to be up against the leader of the uprising. There you are, Benich for a fight. Ravager claimed in a light demeaning star got his eyes. As our full apprehension moves carefully and brought my Ravager down upon him. I found out the first blow, but not the second. What is done, I roar in victory. He's severely injured. Also, yeah, you haphazard brute, the shout carries over the plains. Whereas I'm fighting a close battle alongside my personal guards. In a distance, I see enemy reinforce coming away. Listen, I begin, my soldiers. Yeah, as I look up to my father, I mean, knowing what he would do. He hasn't killed more yet up there. You know what we have that they don't? Each other! Be more inspiring. Let's help out the Polish. Which I think we may have to bring whole armies up this way. To Pressburg. I guess the local vassal levies too. Even though they do make some difference. At least 200 each. Matrilineal marriage. There we go. You've got yourself a strong and attractive man. Oh yeah. 
need a new set of armor. My hunting dog ran away and went for a woman in the castle. He was very aggressive, chasing several servants and sent them fleeing in terror. And came upon a favorite dog and one of my courtiers attacked it and killed it. Unfortunate. Guess we got a rough dog. Rough dog. <laughs> Want to control the Duchy of Bavaria? Now how do I do that? They're at war. A Bavarian Civil War, so you're gonna have to wait. The infidels should trouble this new castle on the County of Hebron. Or what's left of it. It's under Byzantine control now. Next to Armenia. When is the next crusade? Okay, 1265. Nobate it is then. I guess they just want to get rid of the Africans and expand their power here, which we will not allow it. Sanko the Armorsmith. Oh, holy crap! Everybody's coming here. Well, I'm fresh off of a duel. My uncle lost an eye. And he's doing alright. Stephina's still alive? Well, okay, this is your last battle, because we need some inspiration. This is Plains territory, right? In Marienburg? Yes, Plains, so... Yeah, he stays there. Oh, this is gonna hurt. And reinforcements are just too far away, due to oversight. No Polish is going to help us, but they will take a major river crossing penalty. But there's just so many. And of course, that name of that Prussian county, Marienburg, rings a bell of some bad memories for me. Not in Crusader Kings, but some older game, older strategy game. Armor with highest quality. Just want to reiterate. I'm using the Ravager, and I have the Armor of the Cross that they give to me. So whatever happens, just be brave and don't be a puss. Remember, be brave and don't be a puss. Stana, I didn't know you are a commander. Who keeps giving out their sympathy for Muslim religions? It's it's the Shia out there, the secret Shia society. They're out there. Hold your damn ground. As I'm swinging my braid vigorously in front of me, my trusted dog nags at the, gnaws at the legs of my enemies. The battle rages over on, over the coming plains. There's a cry from a soldier nearby. Incoming arrows, my lord. Watch out. Wait, is that a dog? Come back. Huh? You! How dare you! I'll kill him myself, and the soldiers will tend to my dog. My grip is covered with cramping around my ravager, as Ake races for another attack. All in moments are a blur. Blood suddenly everywhere. Somebody shining. Did Emperor Ostea sever his head from his body? I'm sorry that I ended it this way. No, I'm not sorry. You try to kill my dog. He deserves to be dead. Mr. Old Man's dog, you're gonna get your head cut off. Yeah. 
<laughs> you guys are famous for your axes, but my axe yep, severed a man's head just for hurting my dog. Killed by me. Yeah, you better run out of here. Never want to see your presence again. Just hold your positions, not this area. <sighs> I told you this was her last battle. Time for you to earn your pay. What the hell? Hey, don't you know you have a heathen in your kingdom? And how did he conquer that? What the hell? Lots of unprepared invasion of Africa. That's why he has so many out there. What was the old armor's name? He's a cable. Quick, yes. Hope you live long enough to be the Grandmaster. I don't care how long you reign as Folkmeister. Just you have the distinction of being both Emperor and Hogmas. Champion was the old name of that armor. So, everyone shall fear the Warden. The Warden, ladies and gentlemen. Put this on. Forged out of the finest materials and with expert craftsmanship, this armor turns its owner to a stalwart barrier against any foe. Damn right. Ah, uh, here we go again. I'm ready for some more. Bring it on. Don't send reinforcements. And I'll get these guys too. And we got a shield maiden. It was pretty old for a range, but... Oh, the wife of the Duke of Matsovia. Didn't know you have allies. Ah, she became bloodless. Come on, bring it. I'll take you all on. Me, my Dalmatian uncle, and this Bosnian woman who just keeps on killing. Now we can go home and face actually. Just a way to tell him to stop helping me.
Oh, that means I can't declare any wars. Unless somebody calls for help. You got 10,000 and how much do they have? You're fine. Where'd you get all that? Mercenaries? You got a lot of money, so you're financially covered. Well, it's time to go hunting for once. This is something I've wanted to do for a long time. I've never been given that chance. Huh. A white heart has been seen in the north of Zahumia. I've told a heart of ten is the biggest deer I've ever seen. This is my coup. By golly, I got it. The business team just keeps on advancing. Taking out most of the Norwegian holdings. And in the future, I think it's high time to do another great conquest because of all the amount of territory they hold. Yeah, sure. So you were originally served, but now you turned, um... You've been Hellenized as Greek. Bogoslav. Just the way it was back then. The Serbo-Greeks, the Greco-Serbs. Just like old times. Except the Slavic faith is what's missing. Hmm. The fall of Jerusalem. The kingdom of Jerusalem. Alright. I think this is about as far as the Mongol Empire is going to get. At least to me. Contemplating, looking into the future. But the problem is, if you declare any war, then, um. No, oh, no, no. It's fine. He's not a member of the defensive pact against me. I mean, I could declare a great conquest for Bulgaria just to give Bulgaria some more land. So they'll have the power. Which no doubt it will benefit them in the long run. You are excommunicated. Let me left you. No? This is a Pope neutral or something? Oh, I don't think he's from the Empire anymore. No, no but oh, there's only one. But I don't have the money nor the luxury to be doing that these days. The Cyclops thirsted for blood this channel afternoon. They brought us many hairs. This is a fine sport. I just wanted to dedicate my whole life to hunting. Oh, yeah. Wait. No, Revolt War is still ongoing. You're still gonna have to wait. Yeah, spread bad rumors about me. Like if I care. Ain't no one gonna be rebelling. Oh. Oh, hmm. well, he's a nice guy, but what can you do? And I'm working on it. B. Please. Well, I just have to ask him. Hey. 
What is this for reason? It's for Gavokine. Gavokine is good. So where's the leader of revolt? You're surrendering because... Oh, excuse me. A uh, piece of uh, Bavaria here because... Uh, you know, I'm losing end here. Okay, now. The fairy is all yours. Here you go. And, uh, the county as well. Anything else that you need? That's all. Good on you. More power to you. Hospital in one case has been seeing an increase in the amount of people looking for food and shelter lately. They can barely provide for the food requires it is. Perhaps this could be a good opportunity to make an impression. So make the preparations at once. Food and supplies handed out of here. Well. Oh, I'm already Kagari, so I'll just say God made it possible. One of my scouts report a cunning eunuch who has taken up residence in a nearby tavern. The eunuch spends his time drinking, wine, eating, sharing stories with the guests. Apparently he is very well schooled and has a vast knowledge of medicinal mi mixtures. With an offer of gold and food, he definitely convinced him to take up residence in my court as a physician. Hold up with cheese and wine. We got ourselves a court eunuch named Martininosa. Off you go. But so what happened to Seljuks? Yeah, the Abbasids have made a comeback. Suzerain of the Knights Hospital here. Man, now they pay taxes to him. Oh, how the mighty have fallen. That's all I gotta say about that. Are we the biggest empire in Europe right now? Just want to check real quick. If we are the biggest... Yes, we are! Alright. I think we made our... This is the last major goal I want to do in this series. I never intended to conquer the whole world like I did with Croatia. Because I was Zoroastrian, where it was basically me versus the world. And this one... I'm trying to be the biggest empire in Europe. And now the Byzantines, well, they're in a revolt, to be fair. What if we beat them in a great conquest one more time, which I want Bulgaria. And then, uh, there you go. You've accomplished everything there is to do in this series. I guess Austria isn't much of a screwball after all. Yeah, he had his moments, but still. In about four years, I'm going to start looking for a woman. Because, you know, one day, Ostia's gonna have relations, Ostia's gonna have relations. My hunting dog ran away and, oh my, uh, another dog killed by my dog. Oh, I'm sorry to know that. My liege, please listen to me. The man that you're so fond of is more than a treacherous to pick up a snake. King Lyosaw tries to convince you of being more careful with friends. 
What friends? I'm just... Just gonna say... Why... Liar! Liar, liar, liar. The good. Let's be your name. Ah, Ronnie Trickster. Are you sure you're doing all right over there? Yes, you are. My father. Father Vertigo. He did it. My father is the Grandmaster. The Hawkmeister. From Emperor the Hawkmeister. And he did all this with the gout. The next set of tonic says just simple morality. My mother has gone to see him. They're finally to get her again. We gotta find that guy. Who's. Where is that secret shield society that's in the Empire? Yeah. Let's go the right. And he's got all that stuff. Which I will never get it back. Orthodox scripture. Okay, just burn the apostate. He's zealous. No one. No one. Don't worry, Mr. Nice Guy. Alright. <laughs> you know what? I think it's about that time. One more war for this episode. The Teutonic Ward for Vic. Yeah, I'll be glad to sign up. I'm coming, Daddy. Just trying to think. What's missing? There it is. I was just had a little moment of myself. As I said, any help is appreciated. Hope you live long enough. Okay, that's all I need to know. I'm just happy to know that Father is the Grand Master. Dear Son, never thought I would read that. Dear Son, blessings upon you and your house. I gladly accept your offered assistance in my war. Let your enemies tremble. Hawkmeister Vertigo. This is surreal. I thought I made a stupid decision two episodes ago and now. Look at this. We're going to have ourselves a family reunion. In Smithio. Just get our troops up soon enough. And we're going to be right on out of here. Oh, and uh, take the retinue with you. I don't care what happens up there. Oh wow, Koyava, the Huntress. I know you're Chase, but I think I found my match. You know how I was holding off the marriage? I want her. We have something in common. I love to hunt. She's the Huntress. Let's get married right now. Even if she's a lowborn, I don't care. This is the person. This is the exact person I want. Bingo. Glad we got married before we um, send off. So come on, move your asses on. We're gonna be late. This war's gonna be over by the time we get here. Wow. 
Wow, room for everyone. But remember, four army groups. Standard procedure. Four army groups and a retinue. Now, all aboard! Man, I'm so excited. Is this area disease? Oh, it's coming from down here. As I said, we're gonna be late. The war is gonna end by the time we we land ashore. And I don't care what happens up there. Burn all the Orthodox. And the Shia as well, if they're found to be secret members. Young Katharina often speaks in reverence of the wise women of old. She wants to be like a, my Dalmatian cousin. Oh yeah, the other ones. Who's married to the Finnish princess. What a lovely child. And one day I'm going to start intervening on the wars of the West against uh, Britannia. Because it seems no one could stop them. I guess Norway's busy. Yeah. Busy. Mm -hmm. Take it parts of Lithuania. Okay, how do we distribute an army of that size? Okay. Here's what we're going to do. My army will land here. We're just going to split evenly. And another will go to Gothland. Dalmatian cousin. Hold on, what's going to be difficult about, you know, now I'm married and there's her is that uh, she's chaste and I'm homosexual. You know, after this whole war is over, and whenever I get bored of hunting, I'll go for family. Okay, now let's set our army. Land and go front. After the Baltic and another will go to Estonia. We're just distributing evenly. I'm just trying to demonstrate myself of how can I be a tactician. like fighting in multiple fronts. Just demonstrating. So yeah, hey Pops, that's all I gotta say about it. Yeah, Father, look at me now. I'm the Emperor. I honestly did not screw up your empire that your ancestors have worked so hard to build. And that's the winter. I think we have to come down here. 
Uh, the, the retinue. Okay, cancel that trip of sending the retinue to Lapland. Land down here. Work your way down. Yeah. We made a mistake. Man named Vladislav, the hunter. <laughs> well, too bad. Uh, Koyaba's taken. We want to pick up as soon as it's over. As we settle down and for the night in Westfold, a comet passes overhead. The soldiers started talking excitedly what it means. Let us take a moment to thank the Lord for this miracle. Tommaso Valpaga, the wise. Yeah, the wise guy. Alright, it's over. Everybody come home. We just went up here, look at the comet. But hey, at least we were close enough to say, it's like, hey, father, how do you like me now? I'm the Emperor of Bosnia. You're doing God's work. Keep it up. I just got married, Hodder. Oh yeah, nice to have a family reunion up in Smithfield. All right, let's go pick up the rest before they all die of a cold or something. A Teutonic Order thanks for your aid throughout the war in Vidkin. We send you a small gift to show our appreciation for your assistance. But hey, it was the least I could do, Father. Is this what I think it is? The Holy Primpius. It's it's for me. I knew my father had it, but this is a uh, the foreskin of Jesus Christ. Fertility bonus. Oh, thank you, Father. Apparently, somehow you found a carbon copy of this. I don't know how you do it. This is why Father and Son, both greats. He's the great, I'm the great, we're all great. And I hope my wife is great, which I'm going to have to start swaying. And I hope you get well soon, too. <laughs> Yeah, you gotta stop that neutron vault before, you know, all hell breaks loose. <laughs> hell, I'll be there too. Elizabeth well, does direct leader. Give her that. I would rather be the flanker. And let the Frenchman come too. This is a bad flu. Call the court physician. Quick! The dancing plague is in Vitola. It's over there. Oh, uh, here we go again. This is the third time in this playthrough. I, this has never happened to me. I thought this is a once in a playthrough. But three times in one playthrough? Too many Christmas, what the world is coming to. That's another thing about me, of being all stay out of grade. I'm just being one talkative sense of beeswax. We took care of those guys. Alright, set full sail. Bring our balls home. Wait a minute. Why am I thinking of that idea? Yes! Sahumia has got a new holding. Get a city. We want that city, and we want it now. Hold on, yeah, he feels like he's 77. If 
feels like you've been forever, steward. Tell me a secret of how you lived so long. All right, she's all better. Just, I just want to sway her. Just uh, get her to like me more and hopefully have a pregnancy. Start having uh, my children. She may be born normal. So what is this, by the way? Okay, there you go. What the hell kind of hat is that? Is that what hats of the princes of France wear? Well, it looks like um, they're about to be gone forever. The photos it's The Caliphate will be gone soon. And Jerusalem will be gone soon too. Even though the Byzantines now hold the most of Jerusalem, but not Jerusalem itself. Because that is in the Muslim country. Whenever they have finished their revolt, we might consider going to war against them. Slava, who's one-eyed? Where the hell do you find these women? <laughs> now you just recruit them out of the blue, regardless of background. Orthodox scripture giving praise to Lucifer. Burn. Moldovian war for a duchy claim. Uh, where are you from, by the way? Oh yeah, we're gonna kill you. Alright, the new city in Zahumia is called, um, Omis. Omis. Right. Now, get back to collect the text. Who can be the designated reader? Serbia. Oh, wow. I didn't know you were a giant. Why can't we have a court giant? If if there's a court dwarf, a court eunuch, we ought to have court giants. I ain't scared of can have some of the relations. Bohemia can handle that. Oh wait, that's my nephew. A strong nephew at that. Also, for a moment, did it said Princess of the Teutonic State? 
Right. It's because of father. I guess that makes me the prince of the Teutonic State as well. Just by being a Bravo. I see, I see. I mean, she's not at the Teutonic State, but that's just by name. She plays hard and talks straight. Be brave. Told you. Can't teach that. Just get this war over with and we'll finish this episode. For scout. No, I think you got it. Vladimir Lukovic. Serbian. Vladislav Babunic. Oh, the kind. Yeah. He, he, he's blessed too. Okay, defeat him one more time and we win. Still think you got it. I have my confidence in you. Huh. Most impressive woman has recently arrived in my coat. Apparently, the reason for her visit is to arrange a trade agreement with the local merchants. Well, wow, people did not think of much of her at first, but I've heard of many courtiers uh, praising her savvy business sense. What's your stewardship score? 20. Well, that's one better than my... than my old one. But she's gone. All right, you should work for me. Mara, the gardener. As per usual. Fatigue. Camp fever? Can't be. There is no camp fever around here. Okay. It's over. So just get back home. Huh. Oh, I forgot. Now there's what little is left of the, the blasted. Oh yeah, they're taking care of that right now. Empire is gone for good. Reconquista complete. Want me to sleep hanging upside down for a couple of days? Glad I hired Amante Ninosov. You know, the eunuch. Just send a good letter. We really, really like each other. We're really expanding the Imperial borders up there. Oh, I have the gout like my father. Father! I have the gout just like you. Tell me what's the correct treatment. If you have experience with such things. As long as you know what you're doing. Test if my humors were out of balance, and the best way to restore will be through bloodletting. After consulting my astronomical charts, he decided it should be blood from my armpits and temples. Found a treatment, Father. I know how to take care of the gout situation, just like you. Fortunately, that hurts my much. Okay. One last hunt. Because I don't do much of. Son of a beeswax. Okay. Get out of here. All of you. 
flashback. Taking little bits of money out of you. Ooh, big one. Next episode, let's find up to. But a question is, what is he, Britannia, up to? If I see them expand one more time, I'm intervening. We're gonna have to stop him, and it's gonna get worse. It's a martial skill. He's gonna bring it to the table. And my father is still alive, and he's emulating a legend, which he's cynical. No, why'd you do that, Dad? You were supposed to be zealous, not cynical. Now you're going to be, uh, you're not going to be blessed for your such thinking. But nonetheless, I respect you. And, and you did convert your culture to German just to keep with the traditions. I understand. So all that and more on the next episode. About five years, a new crusade. Other things may occur in the future, but only time will tell. Till then, so long for now.